This here says the COVID-19 vaccine from 60 years ago might kill the Boja? Isn't that the vaccine that transformed 80% of the population into violent mutant creatures? Yes. We should use them as a mindless zombie army to help us defeat the Boja. Agreed. But now it's time to continue learning. Today, we're going to cover topography in UI design. Let's get started. Your task today will involve fixing the topography of three different user interfaces. Here is the first user interface. This looks like crap. There are a number of typographic issues. Let's start with alignment. Notice how some of the type is left aligned and some is centered. You should strive to create consistent alignment across your type. Left aligned all of the text. Next, there are too many fonts. Select all of the text and change it to a font that looks better. No, never Comic Sans. Choose Poppins. You can't go wrong with Poppins. Let's talk about leading. Leading, otherwise known as line height, is the physical distance between lines of text. Notice in this paragraph, there is too little white space between the lines of text. Increase the leading. Good. Next. Contrast and topography is important. The WCAG, or Web Content Accessibility Guidelines, suggests a minimum contrast ratio of at least 4.5 to 1. The contrast on the body type is only 2.96 to 1. Increase the contrast, John. Got it. The objectives type is not as important as the headline beneath it. Decrease the size of the type. Make it bold. Increase the tracking, or the spaces between the individual characters, and give it the primary blue color that's used in this UI. Done. Finally, the title within the white container does not contrast enough with the paragraph type beneath it. You want to establish good typographic visual hierarchy. If two pieces of type that are semantically different do not look different enough from each other, it results in a user interface that's hard to use. Make the title bold to see the difference. Excellent. You've gone from this design to this. I've got it. What next? In this design, I want you to make adjustments on your own to improve the topography. Well, the alignment and lack of white space here sucks. There's also none of that visual hierarchy, so I will increase the size of the title, make it bold, and also make adjustments to the date so that each of the three pieces of type are styled differently from each other. Very good, John. Here's a final test for a mobile navigation. This time, create the type from scratch. Place your name in a label underneath the user avatar. Then, place five different navigation items to the right of each icon. Done. John, this is great. You are now proficient in topography as it pertains to building user interfaces. I feel like I'm even more ready now to kick some Boja ass.